All right, so this is going to be a Costco sale item review, <clears throat> excuse me, of these Foster Farms Takeout Crispy Wings, uh, Sweet Chipotle Barbecue. Normal price, $18.49. It was $4 off, so $14.49, $14.50-ish. <clears throat> All right, and this is a four-pound bag of chicken. Okay. So gluten-free, ready to eat, uh, ready to heat and eat. <clears throat> ready in about 16 minutes from your air fryer. So we're going to air fry these. Okay, chicken wing sections with a sweet chipotle barbecue sauce, sauce packet included. Go. It has a tear open resealable packaging. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the back here. Sauce and toss. Okay. And there we go. Not all wings are created equal. One bite of our crispy signature wings, and you'll know why we start with fresh, deliciously seasoned chicken. Then we fry them just long enough to ensure each is perfectly crispy on the outside, yet oh so tender on the inside. Medium hot sauce, heating instructions from Frozen. Uh, so you can do a baking sheet in the convectional oven or convection oven and the air fryer. Cook up to 12 wings in a preheated oven at 425 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 to 22 minutes or at 475 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes for 3.25 pound full bag of wings. <coughs> All right, so higher temperature for more wings. Cook up to 12 wings in the convection oven uh, in a preheated oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 14 to 16 minutes or at 460 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes for 3.25 pounds full bag of wings. Um, I don't know if I should try making all the different methods. Um, I'm pretty sure I'll like the <coughs> the air fryer method best. Preheat air fryer to 390 degrees Fahrenheit. Arrange frozen wings in a single layer in basket. <coughs> Excuse me. Heat for six minutes. Oh man, my throat's going on. Heat for 16 minutes or until heated through. For extra crispy wings, cook for an extra five minutes. Uh, microwave oven is not recommended. Sauce instructions. Four three-ounce packets included. Thaw sauce packet in warm water. Toss heated wings in sauce just before serving. Best Buy, um, April 17, 2024. <clears throat> so close to a year. About a month less than a year. So 11 months. Chicken raised with grow <coughs> growth promoting. No antibiotics. Wait, what? <laughs> Chicken raised with no growth promoting antibiotics. Okay. Chicken raised with no... With added... <laughs> <laughs> they make it, it reads wrong. Chicken raised with no added hormones or steroids. Okay. Here are the nutrition facts. <clears throat> serving size per container. Okay. So I hate when they do this with the serving, or with the nutrition facts, because it's hard to read with this line all the way over here, since they didn't do like different varying colors in the background. But here you go, the wings and the sauce. So about nine wings, or nine servings per container. Um, which is a three ounce of edible chicken, and then eight, about eight servings of sauce, two tablespoons per serving. All right, <clears throat> total fat, nine grams, 12% for the wings, no fat in the sauce, 2.5 grams of tra uh, saturated fat, 13%, right? 75 milligrams of cholesterol in the wings, 25%, 330 milligrams of sodium, 27% in the wings, 320 milligrams of sodium in the sauce, 14%, 4 grams of carbs in the wings, 1%, and 20 grams of carbs in the sauce, 7%, all right? <clears throat> 20 grams of Oh shoot, sorry. 4 grams of fiber in the sauce, 14%. Less than 1 gram of sugar in the wings, 18 grams of sugar in the sauce. Um, less than 1 gram of added sugars in the on the wings, and 17 grams added sugar in the sauce, 34%. Protein, 12 grams, 22% in the wings. <coughs> Excuse me. And then all you got is potassium, 130 milligrams, 2%. Let's see the ingredients here. <clears throat> chicken wing ingredients, chicken wing sections, water contains 2% or less modified food starch, salt, rice, flour, uh, sodium phosphates, maltodextrin, dextrose, natural flavors, <clears throat> algin, par fried in vegetable oil. The sweet chipotle sauce um, has sugar, water, tomato paste, brown sugar, distilled vinegar, corn syrup, salt, modified corn starch, molasses, pineapple juice, con uh, pineapple juice concentrate, dried chipotle chilies, Spices, tamarind puree, natural smoke flavors, anthem gum, garlic powder, um, 
onion powder and natural flavor right made by foster farms and if you have questions or comments there's their phone number and their instagram facebook and twitter okay all right let's open this up and take a look inside <coughs> and then we'll air fry maybe air fry and bake a few <coughs> let's see oh it's gonna take a while i'm, I'm just gonna air fry it i know it's good either way um, Costco actually had some samples here, but this is what they look like. So I'm going to air fry. I guess I'll air fry and bake a few um, since I have that oven thing, but then I'll have more dishes. <coughs> okay. So, oops, I dropped a wing. So you got these little drum ones and then the wings. <coughs> and then you got four packets of the sauce, two connected to each other. Okay, let me go. <clears throat> Excuse me, bake these up, see if I can fix my throat issue, and I'll be back. See you guys in a bit. Alright, so I got two in the convection set on turbo convect mode <clears throat> for 16 minutes. Two in the air fryer, 20 minutes because it said it'll make it extra crispy, so we'll see how that tastes. And then we have two more waiting to put in the oven for baking mode. Alright, you can see about nine minutes in. It's all sizzling. Snap, crackle, pop. Let's take a look at the air fried one. About nine minutes in on this. I don't think I want to do the full 20 minutes. I feel it's going to burn. So we'll just do 16 minutes. Five minutes to go. That's what we got. All right, back to the air fryer. Look at that. It's way more burnt outside. So I don't know. Usually the air fryer cooks a lot faster. So I don't know why they use the same amount of time. We'll find out. Maybe because the temperature is a little lower. Alright, about two minutes to go. Look at that, they're super dark. I think if you do 20 minutes, they'll be burnt. Two minutes to go on here. All snap, crackle, and popping. Then we'll start baking them soon. Alright, a few seconds left to go. We'll take them out. Alright, let's take a look. Let's see if I'm going to end up burning my hands. How hard are these things? Yeah, they're all right. Okay, we'll grab that out and grab that out. There you can see the baked ones, the air fried ones next to the raw ones. Okay, we are gonna have to add the sauce. The oven is ready, so let's go ahead and grab those out. Those, I'm not gonna be able to just grab it out because the oven is too far in there. So let's see, I'm gonna get an oven mitt, I'll be back. All right, let's pull this out. Oh, it's stuck to the pan. Oh, I didn't spray non-stick stuff. Whoops. Okay, so you can see it sticks there a little bit. Get that. Come on, let go. Might have to do this with two hands. I need one to hold the tray. Yeah, give me a second. Okay, loosened it up. Let's grab that. And here you can see. All right, we're gonna have to bake the other ones, so let's do that. I'll sauce these up and try them first. All right, so we got those in there baking for 20 minutes at 425. We'll see how they turn out. Let's get these all sauced up. One thing to take note of, the sauce packet, when I was trying to separate, it tore, so I couldn't use the warm water. Um, so I probably need to like microwave this for a little bit or something. Let me microwave it for like 10 seconds. 10 seconds wasn't long enough, so I put another 15 seconds. Let's see how it does. Okay, it seems like it's good. It's a little bit steamy, um, and it's nice and warm, so I think we should be good here. Ooh, okay, I don't need all that sauce. I actually had some water in the bowl, so oops. All right, let me get that out. Give me a second. All right, so got most of the water out. Let's squeeze this sauce out of the packet. I'm not really gonna toss them around in there. I'm just gonna dip them in and eat them. But uh, yeah. All right. So get that. All right. Got the sauce out. And give me a second. I'll be back. Okay. Here you go. We have the wings and the sauce. I can tell these are way crispier. But let's go ahead and dip them in. So I'm just gonna roll them around in there. Okay. Shake off any excess. All right, let's give it a try. It's super hot, actually. Mm. It 
the vinegar <coughs> ooh, <clears throat> hit me right away in the nose. <laughs> mm, very sweet. <clears throat> Tangy. That's smoking. Mmm. Excellent wings. Mm -hmm. Good flavor. Spice isn't too hot or anything. So if you're looking for something really spicy, this won't be it. But it's very tasty. Oh, oops. Let's side-by-side -side comparison with this. Now I messed up because that's going to get more soggy. But... Hopefully this is enough sauce for the wings I took out. Get it on there. Okay, let's try this one. Mmm. Definitely more crispy. Mm-hmm. You probably don't need to cook it as long in the air fryer. Mm -hmm. Very good. Mm -hmm. mm. Alright, let's go ahead and try the little drum thing. Get some sauce in there. Alright. <sighs> Let's give that a try. I tried to get equal size little drum pieces because there were some that were super huge. Mm -hmm. Really good. Chicken's nice and tender. Juicy. Mmm. Be careful not to inhale the fumes of the chicken. <laughs> of the sauce, I mean. Because when it goes down, it burns. <laughs> mm -hmm. Very tasty. Let's roll this one in there. I can hear how crispy it is. Wow. Okay, I can't even get all the sauce on that one. I think they actually might need to give more sauce. <laughs> Either that or I need to cook a whole bunch and just shake it all up in the sauce because this way you see we're not getting much sauce on it yeah and I don't think I'm gonna have enough for the other two pieces we'll see all right let's give this one a try hmm mm hmm very good Sweet and tangy. Mm. So good. Highly recommend these. To me, they're much better than the buffalo wings. Personally, I'm not much for buffalo style sauce. But um, this stuff is super good. Mmm. Hopefully the baked ones will be done soon, and then I can show you those.
Mm-hmm. Very good. All right, let's wait for the oven ones, and we'll be back. There we go. Ten and a half minutes-ish left. That's what it looks like. And we'll get to do the taste testing. All right, two minutes left to go. Looking good. All right, it's ready. Let's go ahead and grab these out now. Okay, I'm probably going to need two hands again because they're probably going to be stuck to the tray. Yep. Give me a second, I'll be back. Alright, we're back. So let's go ahead and sauce these up. They're going to be super hot inside because they're just fresh out of the oven. But uh, get that all sauced up. This one all sauced up. Ooh, that's hot. Get the sauce all around. It's probably better if you cook a whole bunch at the same time and then shake them all up. Um, then you get a more even coating, but this is what we're going to do. Okay. So. All right. Got to let it cool down a bit because it's probably going to burn my mouth. But let's see here. Maybe this one I can try real quick. <clears throat> That's what it looks like. Let's give it a bite. Mmm. So good. Baked actually turned out really nice. Mmm. Mmm. Mm hmm Honestly, I think air fried I would actually do for less time, not more time. Um, it would probably turn out better. The chicken should already be pre-cooked, like fully. So basically you're just crisping the outside more. Mm -hmm. Very tasty. Ooh. This is hot. Mm -hmm. I feel air frying 16 minutes was a little overcooked. Um, this one tastes really good, but since I didn't have it side by side, it's hard to tell. I think no matter which way you cook it, it's really good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Very tasty, very crispy. Let's get the last one. Mm. Very good wings. Highly, highly, highly recommend these. <clears throat> yeah, next time you're at Costco, you see these on sale, go get yourself a bag, unless you hate the flavor of the barbecue sauce. But it's so good. Mm-hmm. So hot and steamy. Yeah. So that's pretty much it. I'm going to finish eating this. Again, if you see this at your Costco, go get them. Give them a try. Thanks for watching. I'm going to finish eating this on camera and then... Yeah, this is so good. Ooh, too hot. I'd say this is one of my top food recommendations from Costco. This and their pizza thing that they had. Um, I forgot what it's called. I think it was like a deep dish pizza or something. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Yeah, definitely recommend these. All right. Thanks for watching. See you all in the next one. Bye.